Collector limpets can be used to collect items such as materials, cargo, and mining fragments. You'll need three things to use collector limpets. A collector limpet controller, which is an optional ship module. Limpets are items, not ammo, so you'll need a cargo rack to store them. And of course you'll need some limpets. Limpets can be purchased by going to the advanced maintenance menu and selecting restock. Limpets are generic and can be used with any type of controller. You'll need to assign the collector limpet controller to a fire group to use it. You can do this on your right side internal panel. You can use multiple collector limpet controllers on the same fire group. The size and rating of the collector controller will change the range and lifetime of the limpet. B-rated controllers have higher range but lower lifetime. The A-rated controller might not always be the best option, depending on what you're doing. You'll need to lower your cargo scoop so the limpets can deliver the item to your ship. You'll see an error if your cargo scoop is closed and blocking the limpet. The limpet will follow you with the item until you lower your scoop or the limpet expires. There are two ways to use collector limpets. The first way is to target an item and fire the collector limpet controller. The limpet will collect the item, bring it back, and then stop existing. Trust me, they're fine with it. The other way is to fire the collector limpet controller with nothing selected. The limpet will collect everything in range until they expire. More on that later. Limpets will collect everything in range in untargeted mode. This can sometimes pick up illegal or stolen items. You can ignore items in your left side external panel by selecting the item in the contacts tab and selecting add to ignore list. You can use the same process to remove items from your ignore list. If you jettison an item, the limpet will try to collect it if it's not in your ignore list. You can use the abandon option to jettison an item and the limpet will ignore it. You can also use limpets to collect limpets. This is useful if you're mining or collecting a lot of cargo with limited cargo space. Jettison the limpet and ignore it, collect the other items, and then remove the limpet from your ignore list after a few of them expire. There are a few ways a limpet can expire. Ideally, the limpet will survive the lifetime listed on the controller. A limpet can also expire by flying out of its range. Going back in range of the limpet will not bring it back. Limpets do not travel at the same speed of your ship. Keeping your cargo scoop lowered will reduce your speed, but you can still outrun them depending on the speed of your ship. The most common way a limpet will expire is by running into objects or taking damage. Limpets aren't very smart when it comes to finding your ship, so positioning is important. Try to give the limpet a clear path to your cargo scoop if you can. And that's the basics of collector limpets. Hope this helps. Have fun and fly safe.